He stands at three inches, three feet, 11 inches tall and has limited use of arms and legs. But that's not stopping one man from living big dreams. Tonight, news specialist Dan Rascone takes us up close with this unique piano man. Dan? 26-year-old Colton Purcell is all about no excuses. He lives that every day. And all you have to do is meet him to see that he truly practices what he preaches. Inside a home in Mapleton, complicated piano numbers can often be heard. Not unusual until you see who is at the keyboard. 26-year-old Colton Purcell, who has a cursed spine, deformed arms, and legs, and hands with arthritis. Yet he somehow managed to become an accomplished collegiate level pianist and composer. A lot of the work actually is listening to it over again. Writing his own notes. So in my heart. Performing his own songs. And four days a week, Major. He's a professional piano teacher, D flat. helping young students to accomplish their musical goals. Well, looks like you practiced that well. <laughs> that was great, man. Colton says all right. it's all about not so giving up. I had to figure out my own way to do it because I can't do things the way normal people do them. Colton was born with a rare form of dwarfism called metatropic dysplasia. At a very young age, his dad started him on the piano as a form of therapy to keep his hands from tightening up. He wanted me to be able to grip things and be able to experience life. It was his grandma, who is a professional pianist, that took him to the next level. While sitting on the piano, Colton showed me the challenges he faces while playing. I can go like this, but you can't. No, I can't. My rotator, my rotator is not very good. Colton has managed to become self-sufficient, doing everything on his own to get around his parents' home. He can walk, but only for short distances. Gets more movement in my legs. He manages to stay fit through a variety of exercises, <sighs> including going up and down the stairs. When I was growing up, I had to figure out how to do things, and that's what my parents raised me to do. I used to do this a lot more. It raised me to figure this stuff out for myself, because they knew they wouldn't be able to help me. He may stand at only three feet, 11 inches tall, but <sighs> Colton, is a giant in overcoming his challenges. His secret? Look for what makes you happy, and when you find it, um, use that to move beyond what you think is possible. Pretty amazing what he's able to accomplish. Colton is the oldest of four kids, all of them accomplished pianists. He says he knows of only two others across the country with his rare form of dwarfism. Back to you guys. Great story, Dan. Thank you. And Colton, we salute you. That was absolutely what inspiring. What an inspiration. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's awesome. All right, the fact